Finally, guys. I did it. I did it. I lost, I think, uh, Tao and Gort, and I think that's it. Because I think Chris was asleep. A tomb was way off in the background. But I did it. I killed the stupid marionette. This is definitely one of the toughest boss fights in this game. But welcome back to Let's Retro Shining Force. I got so lucky because he decided not to use freeze level 3 like for every freaking turn. He actually did two melee attacks. And that kept Gort around long enough to actually hit him twice. And I think Gort got a double attack in there. I don't care that I didn't record it. I, I'm, I'm okay with that. But he's down. Marion is defeated. So, let's move on. <clears throat> Fools. Light will never defeat the darkness. She... Oh, that was a woman. Oh, okay. She... That evil woman was going to take me to Runefaust to feed me to a dragon. Thank you. I'm going home and I'm never leaving. Okay. Interesting. All right. But here it is. We, we, we did it. We beat the stupid circus. Yay. Never again. Uh, let me talk to you. It's my fault. I should have noticed that he was in there too long. Thank you, Atune. All right, let's go. Let's let 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 go. Let's go talk to the mayor, dickface. Old man, how you feel? Thank you so much, Atune. Take my ship. It's all yours now. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You you weren't so happy to help us out earlier, huh? Bitch. Hey, you. Thank you so much for saving my son. You're welcome. Never trap me in this room again. It's an actual nightmare. Ooh, yeah. Oh, also, now I can also promote, I think, because I have a few people that hit level 10. Because keep in mind, I've, I've done this like three times now or four. Like, I've had people die a lot. But as you see, I now have 2,000 gold coins. Well, had 2,000 plus gold coins. I made bank. So, I, I've been doing this quite a bit. I lost May, Tao, and Gort. And May I lost because she got hit by the freeze level 2 as well. Which was BS. Or freeze level 3, I should say. Alright, so we're going to promote. Does anyone want to be promoted? Ken. Uh, is Ken on level 10 and a half, really? Oh, okay. Ken wants a promotion? Yes, I hereby make a promotion. Knight Ken shall now be known as a paladin. I love that they have the old, like, the old, uh, Shining Force intro music there, but, like, the old, well, I should, shouldn't say old, but it's still there, but it, it just, it, it was, it was a nice touch. So, real quick, I'm going to see his stats, so I, let's go to items, I guess. Give. Ken. Ken has the spear, the bronze lance, and the power ring. Now, the power ring, I gotta make sure I keep that, you know, not broken. Because, uh, that actually gives him some extra damage. Which is nice, considering all the health he has. So he can actually hit hard and take a few hits, too. Bum, 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 bum. I'm the I'm shopping my very own. Old man. Shade Abbey. He has some connection to Guardiana, but I can't think of it. Shade Abbey? Interesting. You. The mayor's ship is yours. you damn right it is. This ship will do just fine. Let's gather the Shining Force and leave at once. Alright, well, we're here. Oh, hey, 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 whoa, hey, whoa. You defeated my pets, but you won't bother me anymore. You're going to burn. Oh, what's a what? Let's get what? What's a what? What shenanigans? Burn a tomb, burn! You'll serve as an example who will all to all who dare oppose Runefaust. Oh, woo ya woo ya woo ya woo ya. Don't set me on fire, please. Good riddance, insect. Um. A tomb, run! The ship is going down! Let me out, let me out. Can, can I move? Holy, what is this? 
How many fireballs are there? Can you not? You're just leaving. And there goes the ship. Hmm. Now we have a problem. This is bad. That was the only ship in town. Maybe the mayor can help you again. Hmph. <laughs> I mean, he said it was his only ship, so we're kind of... Kind of in a pickle. The biggest pickle. What? They burnt your ship. My ship, I mean. Now we have no single ship in this town. The only other town which has ships is... Uranbatol. That's a long way from here. Are you still determined to go? Of course. Uranbatol is very remote. It's to the far east. Northeast. Go to Shade Abbey first. Ask my son all the details about the journey. Head north to Shade Abbey. You shouldn't have much trouble finding it. Alright. Just, just go north. Then to the north we go. I wonder what would happen if I had stayed there and actually just talked to the fireballs. Bum, ba, dum, bum. Oh wow, no enemy? I just go up here? To Shade Abbey? Maybe? You were a bird! Birdman! Help! My name is Amon. Please save Balbaroy. He'll die unless you help. Balbaroy? Who? We seldom get visitors, but you are welcome. Who are you? There's nothing back here. Never mind me. Hmm. Suspicions. Crypt. No admittance. Do not toll the bells without permission. <laughs> no admittance. I'm going to the crypt. Where? Where am I? What am I doing here? Me? Are you a zombie? Nothing is unusual. Okay, so he doesn't know why he's here. Interesting. Um, my guy, are you just gonna follow me now? What am I doing here? Okay, so he's not gonna follow me. I'm so confused. I don't know what's real and what's my imagination. What is going on in this town? Can I tell the bells? No? Ask not for whom the bell tolls, for it tolls for thee. Sorry, I can't talk to you while on guard duty. Library. A very empty library, mind you. What? What? Okay. This is very strange. It's like they're blocking me in. Uh -huh -huh. Sanctuary. What the? Are you Balbury? Welcome to Shade Abbey. I'm rather busy now. Please see me later. Who are you? Arr. Okay. Oh, so now you move. Enjoy your visit, stranger. Hmm. Something's fishy. I need to get out of here. It's too creepy for me. Chapel. No one is in that direction. The grave is pretty messed up. It looks as if somebody recently dug it up. Here's she messed up. So all these recently dug up? No? Okay, so they're all been recently dug up. Huh? Am I alive or dead? Where am I? What the hell? What is going on here? Um, hmm. Let me see what's... Let me look into this. This is a little fishy. following me. Run! It's a trap! Oh! Been praying. Well, you might. Oh! You and your pitiful shining force cannot be saved by prayers. You won't escape. How fitting that you perish in the former chapel of lights. I leave you now in the care of my minions. Who we'll know well what to do with you. Undead! Dispose of these pests once and for all!
Oh, boy. Oh, God. The squad is, like, way over here, and then he's all separated. I need to, like, body block. Oh, wow, he comes with a whole new outfit, too. Yo, look at my boy Ken getting a fat upgrade. take on the world, my guy. Oh, he even got a new saddle. Oh, wow. New animation, too. Just bops him on the head. Does no damage. Ken, your upgrade did nothing. Um, I'm gonna stay, like, back here, though. I need a body block. A zombie. Okay, okay. Take some good damage. Alright, Hans is level 8. Nice, nice, respectable, respectable. Ooh, good damage on the skeleton board. I need to make sure I get all my guys at least to level 10, like soon. Because the sooner they hit level 10, the sooner I can actually promote them. And maybe Luke can stop missing. Now, note, you do not want to use free spells here. Free spells are terrible in this situation. Whoops. Sorry about that. Alright, six. I'll take it. Max MP increase, that's always good. So, let's pop you here, attack the zombie, if you don't miss, alright, you did full points of damage, you just knocked him, oh, you're level 5, nice. I should probably focus on having a tomb actually level himself up so he's not completely useless by endgame, it's just, I'd rather not have him die, is the problem. Because if he dies, then it kind of just invalidates everything that I just did, and then I have to get everything back. It, it's just a nightmare. Oh, wow. I put Ken back to level one. No wonder that felt weak. Okay. Note to self, if I promote, I gotta be really careful. So it's almost like reincarnating in disguise. You set you back to level one, but you get a massive stat bonus. Alright, those zombies are lined up perfectly for Tal, though, which is good. Because I can hit a whole bunch at once. Hmm. Note to self, don't promote too many people all at the exact same time. Because if everyone gets back down to level 1, they're going to get one shot over and over and over, and I'm going to have to sit there and grind all those levels back. It's going to be a nightmare if I don't have a place that's good for it, or at least a battle that has a lot of enemies in it. Alright, let me body block and heal. No. Gone. He heal himself. Chris can heal Hans, because he's Hans is actually vital. Like, I need Hans to stay alive. Dong, it doesn't matter. Also, there's a Google Chrome logo there, basically. <laughs> Alright, so now we have her over here. Cast Blaze. Hmm, wait, no, that's actually not the best place for her to stay, because I can't hit more than this. Wow, this is actually really bad in where I stand. So if I stand here, I'm only gonna hit the one. Yeah, no. No matter where I stand, I'm only gonna hit two targets. Uh, I'll do this, I guess. If I can do this, I can clear out these two zombies on this side, maybe. I'm killing at least one. And did 10 damage to the other. Okay, respectable. I'll take it. I want a tune. Stay back here, because if he dies, like I said, invalidates everything. Kind of makes it worthless. But wow, you missed! Holy hell, come on! You have one job, man. One freaking job, and not to miss. And somehow you did. All right, kill.
kill the Papyrus wannabe, or just do that damage, it's okay. Alright, Gort, I swear to God if you miss. Thank you. Alright, there we go. 140 points, that's some tank. Alright, so now loop. Mm. That ghoul has a whole buttload of health. Wow, yikes. Hmm. That's actually a bit of a concern. Doing me a little bit of a frighten. How do you miss? Come on, it's a zombie. That's not fair. Oh, this is probably gonna hurt. I got a significant feeling this is gonna hurt. Oof. Yep. I had that suspicion. Suspicion was proven correct. Alright, stab him. Stab the boy. And you miss again. You're letting me down, my dude. You're letting me down. The good news is, I can heal you by a lot. Wow, wait. You're level 1 with 23 HP. Holy hell, you have a buttload. Alright, there we go. Gong, I don't really mind you. You're not that useful. Virus with a sword. Good swing. The good news is, there's no ghoul on this side, it's just zombies. Tao should be able to take those. Ooh, Chris taking a big boy hit. I mean, you're gonna walk into position for her. That's, that's okay. Good swing, good swing. Respectable damage. Alright, Chris should be able to finish that zombie off. As long as Chris doesn't miss. Ah, close, close. Chris doesn't have, you know, that high damage. May's gonna take a hit, but should be fine. Yeah, that did Oh, that's actually kinda bad. Uh, ooh, honor. No killing my- oh god, I was about to say no killing Henri, I need her. I need her for the other ghoul. Or for the ghouls, I should say. The ghoul, ish, think, whatever. I need her for the purple song. Blaze level 2. 10. 10. Okay, come on. Somebody has to die. One zombie dies. Alright, Tiles level 10. I can promote her, actually. That'd be nice. I'm gonna have it to swing. It's really ballsy, but I know the zombie also just went, so he's not gonna be moving anytime soon. The problem is if Gort dies, the ghoul has free access to a tomb, and he's gonna one-shot me. Alright, so now I have Hans. Attack the zombie in the back. Don't miss. Come on, my guy. I hate this game sometimes. I don't understand how their arbitrary dodge mechanic works. It seems to always work in the enemy's favor. Never mind. Alright, that one's dead. Poison inflicts two damage. There's a ghoul. I swear, if he dodges again. Oh my god. This is just gonna be very difficult. I can see why they said this battle is actually very difficult. Because if a tomb gets snatched by any of them. That's it, battle's over. Ken's at full health. I can see why they say this battle is arguably the harder one out of the last battle and this battle. I can see why they say that. The ghoul hits hard and there's a lot of people and you don't really get a lot of breathing like in the last battle. The last battle, you know, you could just stay away from everybody and not die. Now if this guy starts healing, I'm gonna be very pissed. Here we go. It's gonna hurt. Oof. 14 damage. Jesus. Don't kill Gort, please. Don't kill Gort. Gort dies. Ugh. Great. This is a problem. I need Tao to move that way. Oh, I'm gonna lose his cons too. Oh, God. 
Yikes. Now the zombie's swinging. He's probably gonna have health me. Let's go to do it. Because now I've got all these zombies and some skeletons. Like, this is really bad, actually. It's now level 5. Heal became heal level 2. Okay, I'll take it. I can kill the zombie with a tomb. Nice, but not nice enough. I need... I'm gonna do this. This one needs to die. And you miss. Of course. Come on, May. Poison does two more damage. I need to keep Blaze level 5 alive, so. Keep this. Die. 16 points damage. Why can't you save that for the ghoul? Rest. I need this skeleton over here to die. Good hit, Luke. Alright, Ken. I know you're gonna die, but I need your body block. And don't freaking miss. Thank you. Five points damage. I'll respect that. Alright, let me see. I need you to cast heal level two. The bigger boy heals. Alright, we're gonna attack again. And you, of course, you miss. Not surprised, you're like level 3. Going after Ken again, because he's level 1. Ken should survive, he has the HP for it. Yes, very nice. Good job. Good survival. Of course, you're going after Tao. You need to die next. And I need to have Tao go after the pool. Yes, 7 points damage. I need Tao over here. extra damage. I'm gonna try it anyway. Yeah, it doesn't do any extra damage. But she did get a good hit. And you can finish off the zombie here. You can get some good HP with that. Don't miss. Thank you. There you go. Six. Yes. Alright, Soon's getting some XP. He's catching up in levels. But now, I should be in the clear. The poison in the body is too much damage. Now I can surround him. And now... Oh my god. Mm, how do you miss? Again. Oh, come on. Come on, dudes. Come on. Alright. Oh, no. Oh, the double. Hit him for five. I'll respect it. Thank you, Ken. You saved yourself. Being an embarrassment. Let's do regular heal. That's all I got left. If he attacks Ken again, Ken should still survive. As long as yes, okay. Ken should now, when he attacks Ken, he'll be at 17 HP instead. Oh, he went for Tao instead. Oh boy, Tao's dead. Not who I was expecting him to go after. All right, so that means we gotta skip Tao's turn to go to Luke. Oh no, once we tune. Oh, but this is good. This is good. This is good. Good. Now you're dead. Or you miss. Come on. Get one job. Now it's a, now this is actually really scary. Poison. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because if I don't kill this ghoul now, he's gonna kill it too. Thank you. Good job, Ken. You did it. You did it. Thank you. The ghoul is now dead. I am Balbroy. I was turned into stone by Dark Soul when he took the bodies of the dead. I, I guess we got Bulbaroy now. So, uh, welcome to the Shining Force, Bulbaroy. I'll call you Balby. I will join you to fight Dark Souls evil. And there he goes. Wah, 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 wah. 
So all those people there were basically zombies. So there's no priest here either. So, so, so what? Where do I go? Thank you for saving Ball Boy. Let me go with you too so I can fight evil. And Amon has now joined the Shining Force. Amon, a tomb. This is awesome. I've got a whole bunch of outstanding A letter names. Yes. To reach Urban. Urbantol. To reach Urbantol, you must go through Bustok. We will guide you there. I will join your friends. The tomb and the Shining Force head toward Bustok. What awaits there? The legacy of the ancients is still a mystery. Will they ever solve it? Chapter 2 Spirit of the Holy Spring End. Look at that, guys. We made it through Chapter 2. Do you want to record your exploits? No! If any of you know what that was a reference to, I will be super proud. Because that is a very old Let's Player. I don't know if he's even still doing Let's Plays. He might be. He was before Markiplier and before Jacksepticeye. I used to like him. Like, I got into Let's Playing because of him. I'll tell you this. His name starts with a C. But that's not important. Either way. We are now done with Shining Force for today. I know I've said it like three times. But that'll be the end of Shining Force for today, guys. Yes, yes, yes. The Shining Force, right? Must have. Actually, I'll save that for next time. Let's, let's leave that there. Um, <laughs> I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play. Or, sorry, not Let's Play. Let's Retro Shining Force. Hope you all had a great time. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Join the Curly Crew. Hit that notification bell so you already know whenever I drop a brand new episode. And go ahead and leave a comment down below. Share the video with your friends if you think they'll enjoy the whole, you know, retro vibe game thing. Other than that, I will catch you all here next time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.